Oh, ladies Let's and gentlemen, deceased. Backstage. backstage in the locker room, deceased does not look too happy. Is this Sora? Oh no, is that a GF Retro beat? Why does it look like Sora is GF Retro's retarded cousin? What's he going over there with? Why is, does he have a, does he have a fire it, extinguisher in his hand? What the hell? Fire why is he gasping him like that? Oh, what the fuck? No! Is that Johnny Gargano? No! <laughs> oh shit! It's Sora Gargano, ladies and gentlemen. No fucking way! Oh Dude, shit! What is going on? How did that man get that level of costume design? Oh my god! Damn! He's fucking him up, and now he's leaving. How do we introduce the show after just seeing that? I have no idea, Brother X, but we'll try. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sugar Flur, the head commentator, curator, and tag team expert of A, hey, what school do you go to championship wrestling? And this is my tag team partner and fellow commentator, all the X visuals. Yes, sir. Stacked card Stacked. tonight. Shoot fight knockouts only. The next match in round Uso 22, all the X versus Little Deceased and their tag team partners. And ladies and gentlemen, we yes, have, sir, we have round Scorpion two? versus Taz, the hardcore pinfall submission match, and the School Tour Championship match, triple threat shoot, elimination style, knockout submission match with you, J2B, Stitches, and Ruby, the Cherry. We wrote and that now fast. We're going to our first matchup of the evening. Uh -oh. We have a knockout only shoot fight and making his way to the ring, standing at six feet, one inch tall, and weighing in at 230 pounds because of the fake tatics he's wearing. <laughs> in his RuPaul Drag Race costume, your world heavyweight champion, <laughs> Jay to Hill. Now, you really gassed you him like going, that, huh? Yes, sir. What do you think is going through Jay to Hill's mind, knowing that he is stepping into the ring against the dangerous three, the dangerous two-time Fire Pro Inside Champion, Deuce Howard? What it looks like he's doing here is he's um. He's coming in here thinking that he's pretending to be a woman and going into the shooter division. Trying to be a really real good. face here in the division, but a you know. Real face, but he can't do it. He got no, he can't. His wig is all fucked up. He took it. He had a white woman take his braids out. He really juiced up before this event, too. Goddamn. Yes, sir. That man took all the roids. He had the Jose Conseco type beat. Went from J2 skinny to J2 buff in a minute. Yes, here sir. Here comes his, uh, his opponent. J2 trans rights, ladies and gentlemen. And making his way to the ring at six feet, one inch tall, and 181 pounds, fighting out of Southtown. He is the man with the deadly charisma, the king of Southtown, Geese Howard, representing Sugar Flirt Enterprises. Now, you have to wonder what's going through Geese Howard's mind, knowing that he is coming off of his last match, which was a loss to Shooter Seagal at Dia de los Vatos. Excuse me, not even Shooter Seagal. That horrific, horrific ass whooping he took from oh, Screen yeah. and, oh my god, Screen and Taz. That was just disgusting and despicable. Oh, I mean, you know, I, I really do like Geese, but it seems like in the 2K division, he's been getting his ass whooped a lot. I'm hoping he can whoop a, I was going to say a female's ass here, but I'm not too sure we're looking at a female. I don't think we are. I don't think we are. Geese Howard is poised and ready. He's ready for the raging storm, the deadly rave. He is ready and willing to knock this nigga the fuck out. He took the gee off and everything. Big scar on his chest. Here we go. Picking him up. Oh. Goodness. Starting it off with a backbreaker here in the 2K division. J2 tall as fuck, ladies and gentlemen. My lord. Tall as fuck. Yes, sir. If you're wondering why J2 Heel is not joining us on commentary today, it is because he has two matches and he needed time to put on his makeup and fake titties. Tornado DDT. God damn. That was really not strong. I was thinking uh, J2 Heel was already going to get busted open from that uh, DDT. 
That was yeah, a sorry. serious CDD. Oh my god, into the corner. Uh oh. Not look. Ooh, Counter. Quick dodge. Oh. Looking too good. Ooh, big clothesline. Wasn't looking too good at first after taking that Tornado 2 DDT, which he used to retain the title in his rematch against Sugar Flur. Clothesline to the back of the head. Taking him uh -oh. down. He's picking him back up. What do we back got here? Up. Russian oh. leg sweep. Beautiful. Oh. oh look at that. Back up. Beautiful maneuver. Geese is full energy he tonight. Yes, sir. Clothesline. He might be six, he might be 61 years old, but Geese Howard is still poised and ready to go. Drop kick attempt and a miss. I oh, might no. be mistaken. What's J2 Medea doing? Oh, right into the corner. Oh, turnbuckles. Into oh, the God. corner. Being bashed off the turnbuckle by the former women's champion. You have to think that the former women's champion is very, very upset after Dia de los Vatos. Uh oh, DDT. Uh oh, showboating over here from Geese. Taunting them. Definitely showboating. Sugar Flurb Enterprises are a dominant, currently unstoppable uh, association. Yeah, I thought you were going to say a dominant showboating team because that's that's quite uh, true as well. That's quite true as well. Yes, sir. We love we love to show talk about the Flurb Enterprise because uh, we got a main event tonight involving one of them, and that's Stitches. Yes, Might sir. have a chance Stitches. at the. School shooter title. Stitch is taking his shot at the school shooter title after eliminate after being a member Ooh. of the stable that eliminated J2 Heel from the 2K Royal Rumble. Oh, kick, kick to the, the back. Uh oh, what do we got here? Oh, what oh, headbutt. Head, big headbutt taking Geese down. Geese Howard had a strong yet unsuccessful showing in the 2K Royal Rumble against Goku, who was signed yes, by you, Brother X. Yeah, I'm uh, looking to use uh, Goku uh, next week, actually. We have a match set up that'll be uh, talked about later on in the night, so look forward to that. And uh, yeah, Goku's, uh, Goku's got, a, got a match coming up soon. I'm still... I'm oh, jeez. Chin lock, not the chin lock. Not the chin lock. I mean, Kurt Angle's not in this matchup, so... Don't worry Please. about any chin locks here. Please. Oh my goodness. But uh, we do have Geese in this matchup, so we might see a busted open man tonight. Because in every matchup, he yes, usually sir. gets busted open. Yes, sir. Geese loves his blades. Big Ooh, drop kick. Drop kick by Geese. I am Looking still, around. What's going to happen? X, still completely bombasted, hoodwinked, swindled, and bamboozled. Smeckledorf, even, by Sora turning out to be an alter ego. Sora Gargano? I mean, that's that's insane. I was thinking that SoundCloud Sora was a thing, but now SoundCloud Gargano, I'm completely baffled. I'm, I'm shocked. Nah, I, I swear to goodness, we might have, we might be seeing with the leg slaps on it as a oh, future tag team. Here. You know, but but I, I don't like the sound of that. The more that I think about it, though, it does make sense that Johnny Gargano is Sora. Of course, makes perfect sense. Uh oh. The 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 awful hair, the 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 pathetic build. And, and you everything. already know Sora has horrible takes. We can already assume that. Yes, sir, Look at the way Sora right. dresses, ladies and gentlemen. That, Off that into the corner. Abys abysmally. He was, in fact, slowly walking in and dropping the knee. That man Sora is friends with Donald Duck yes. and Goofy. Sora did have a That's job here before. He uh, was a wrestler. And they, uh, it was cool to go to wrestling um, division. He was actually Screen's um, designer before this. Yes, sir. The Keyblades. The what We Are Not Okay. The Roses. Oh, yeah. Everything you've seen screen, where to the ring, sky. has been designed by Sora. Ooh. Yes, sir. Uh-oh. Diaz top. got he's up. Up on the top. Oh. Goodness, a flapjack. Thank goodness this man Geese hasn't been busted open. But no, but he's been getting, getting his ass whooped. I'm not going to lie here. As much as I do like Geese, he's been getting... Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Oh, clothesline. What's going on here? Oh, my God. No, he's knocked out. No fucking way. I might have to get this man off the payroll. Something needs to happen with Geese because that is insane. I was not expecting that. needs to start, ladies and gentlemen. That man, Geese Howard... That man, Geese Howard, got drafted off of Fire Pro and has not been the same man since. <laughs> Oh, I'm depressed. J2 Simmons victorious over Geese Disgusting. Howard here in the shooter division. I am very upset, but we are now moving to the next matchup of the evening, the third round in the round, the third match in the first round of the round Russo tournament. Excuse me, all the X visuals of his tag team partner, Juggalo Kratos versus Lil Decease. Yes, and sir, his, we coming for the seas. And his uncle, Dimebag Daryl Dixon. 
Ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the ring at six feet, four inches tall, and weighing in at 215 pounds. He is the A What School Do You Go To Championship Wrestling Money in the Bank contract holder and one half of the A What School Do You Go To Championship Wrestling 2K Tag Team Champions. He is all the X visuals. Oh, you fucking Coming know it. Coming to the ring, playing this Bobby Caldwell like track known as Glass that he made him damn self because My he is self. an entrepreneur, ladies and gentlemen. You can see the title glistening in the dark. I was about to say, you can't really see much, but you can see that gold. You can see that gold, yes, sir. Here comes my man. And ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the ring at six feet, one inch tall, and standing in at 235 and one half pounds, fighting out of psychotic record studio, Juggalo <laughs> Kratos. <laughs> Juggalo Kratos, yes, sir. Captain Spaulding coming in to whoop y'all asses. Promise you that. If Lil Deceased loses to Dave Meltzer, Hollywood, Hulk Hogan, Vatos Locos, and then Juggalo Kratos, all in succession, he might have to. He might have to. He might have to be put on suspend indefinite leave right now. I'm sorry. I mean, you're not wrong. Maybe, maybe about the first couple guys, but I don't know about Juggalo Kratos. Let's not Lil, give him that that diss. Lil, Lil deceased. Here he comes. He's always Making got something in his hand. The ring. Yes, sir. What does he have in his hand? I don't know. He's now? always trying to blow something up. I don't know. It looked like he threw his Motorola Razor to the ground. <laughs> making his way to the ring with the Suicide Boys playing him in. He is making a slow entrance because he is poised and ready in his attempt to redeem himself after three hilariously humiliating losses in a row, including his, an unsuccessful pay-per-view debut at Dia de los Vatos. He looks pissed. He looks ready, though. He looks very pissed. He's not even wearing the trench coat. He has on some kind of Mick Foley plaid suit jacket. He is definitely, definitely ready for this confrontation right here. Oh, yeah. He's, he ain't happy with the booking that I've gave him. He ain't happy with losing. I know he's ready for tonight. The grimace on his face. He is ready to get his hands on the man who has booked the matches he is unable to win. And his juggalo friend. <laughs> uh oh. Here comes the myth, the man, the legend. Ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the ring, standing at six feet, three inches tall, and weighing in at 217 pounds, fighting out of fighting out of cowboys from hell, it's Dime <laughs> Bag Durrell. Dimebag Daryl looking like a much m looking like the halfway point between deceased and X right now. Yeah, his with a little bit of scorp, with a little bit of scorp in that height. Scorp in there, a <laughs> little bit of scorp there. He's definitely an aggressive competitor. You can see just by his just by look his at his entrance. He's got the view. he's got the appeal. He's got the you know he's he's, he's ready to fight. Appeal. Like he's look at him. Red lights. This is his debut matchup. Can he show out here? If he was to take the Tony Deppin route, I would be super shocked. Yes, sir. Tony Deppin losing in 31 seconds in his 2K debut along with Sora. Two little deceased fellow stablemates, RVD and Val Venus. But can they keep up that record setting uh, streak of Shit. victories here? against uh -oh. all the X Ooh. visuals. Time back Duro with the with this table right off of X's face, knocking oh my him God. down. Already Juggalo bringing him the table to the ring? Feet. He's ready. Table God damn. He's ready. Oh my gosh, look at that. The tag team champion over up. the head. Uh -oh. Spalding. What's going for? Oh, the leg. Racket. The right hand. Oh. Kind of clothesline. Nice clothesline by table, X. But not putting him through it. X is waiting on Dimebag Daryl. He's not. Oh, he tried to go for that punch. He thought he could go for a big punch. No, wait, counter, reverse DDT. All the X visuals is not a Dimebag uh -oh. Daryl fan. Look at that. He's always been a fan of Dave Mustang. Slugger shots. Look at that. Oh, 
right hands just jabbing away oh, at damn. him. Damn. Jabbing away. Big hit, side hip tosses on the much larger competitor. Rolling I him can out already the tell the Dimebag Daryl has got his drugs from Paul Wall tonight because he is He's off got the, the Paul shit. Wall Coke. He got the Mario Judah. He punched that table right the fuck out that nigga's hand. That is atrocious, ladies and gentlemen. Man. Kick to the midsection. Big right Whoa. hand. Oh, uh, whipping him That's out. Holy oh, shit. He just threw him out of the goddamn him. ring. Good An man. RVD. Not too good for Mr. Top Money row. In the Bank. What is he doing? Holy shit. Oh. oh, my goodness. Just big. What a flying, knee. Flying knees God damn. Out Oh, up here. to the table. Dimebag's got X to the table. Off the table. Uh oh. Big chop. chop. My lord. On the outside. What a dime bag chop. Going at it. He's not a Captain Spaulding fan. That man is a Pennywise fan. Yes, He's sir. He's like David. Oh my Big god. Jumping neck breaker by Spaulding. Not looking too good for deceased once not really. again. Oh, we'll try to bring him back in the ring. Bounced oh. Off the uh oh. X got him on the table. Dime bag's not looking X. too good. Big chop again. Chopping, oh my lord. Chopping dime bag, Daryl. Both He's these a men. Slash fan. He's listening to Velvet Revolver. He ain't <laughs> listening to Pantera. He got anthrax on his iPod Nano. Uh oh. Takedown. Quick technical takedowns by Don Bagdero, despite his overtly aggressive uh, demeanor and wrestling style. Reverse whip off Ooh. the... No. Hit him with the counter on that. Rolling him over. Bring him back in. Ooh. Tossing him back in. Oh, right. giant DDT. DDT. On that big Stay Puff Marshmallow Man looking dude. X in the ring with two dangerous fentanyl induced competitors. Uh oh! Wait a minute, scooping him, dropping him. It's going up to the rope. That's a that's yeah. a real scoop slam. Top ropes. Goodness! Split leg moonsault from the top rope. Dimebag Daryl dragging the larger He's competitor got him. up. Oh, X got him in the, corner. in the corner. Corner. Wait, Deceased no! He's trying to protect his tag team partner. Good teamwork here. You would love to see it. Oh! Trying to go for a T-bone suplex. Uh-uh. Through the table. No. Oh, DDT another DDT. It's a DDT night tonight. Holy shit. Yes, sir, it is. The complexity of this matchup just changed. Oh, no. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. No. The seats. No. The seats with the T-bone. Oh, my God. He just brought it through the table. The fuck? He just put Mr. Money in the bank through the table. Oh, my God. Took out one half of the tag team champions. This is the biggest upset of the career. This is bullshit. Oh, big jumping forearm by Dimebag Dime Daryl. He's got a table in his hand. Daryl setting up another table. Right into he's, the corner. He's got the tables on deck. He's got the tables on deck. He's always he's ready. To show Captain Falling oh, that it's time to respect because he's going to make him walk back to the locker room. Yes, sir. Uh oh. Oh. Put him into the table. Two men oh, my on God. him. No. Oh. Going yes, for sir. The, Thank you, Cap. No. Thank you, Cap. out. You got him spalling his hand. Oh no! No! Another DDT busted. Oh, this is giving me open. bad memories, Flurb. Flurb. This reminds me of you at Dia de los Vatos. This is how he feels. Nah, this oh, is how no. I feel right now. Except I put up a better fight than Juggalo Kratos. I'm the real Juggalo here. Oh, Goodness! Man. I went into that match oh. playing uh, Chris Benoit. By I insane clown posse oh, on my iPod show. Oh my god, did you see Super that? Kick Super kick with kick. no legs slap. RVD taunts Spare again? RVD spawns DVD. We know who Deceased's favorite man in this uh, in his group is. It must be RVD. Yes, because. sir. He calls himself Dead Van Dam, but his name stands for DVD because he don't got a Blu-ray player. <laughs> Uh-oh, Dimebag's got him in. Oh, never mind. Oh no, wait Throwing a minute. Uh oh. Bouncing him on uh -oh. the table. He oh, wait. Put him through oh, wait. Yet, no, oh, wait a minute. Back. Oh, my God. Throwing him into the oh, table. Oh, wait. He's got. No. Kicking and then oh, throwing him God. into the table. This is just a string. Wait a minute. Another wait. kick. Holy throwing shit. him into the table. What is this train going to end? Another kick and throwing <laughs> Doral into the table. Holy shit. No, Another not again. The Cease can't have enough. The Cease's got to get this shit to stop. God oh, damn. No. Another kick, and now it's oh. Daryl Dixon into the table. <laughs> Lil Deceased back in the ring, and he's watching as Slash from Guns N' Roses bounces David oh, Jobbins' no. head off the table. And again, how is the table still standing? <laughs> That's oh my question. God, that's still at how are any of these men still that's standing? Still at it. That oh man, my what God. Is doing? That man oh is my God. 
Time bag roasted open. open. He must have. That man deceased is just doing absolutely <laughs> nothing. He must have stole some of the Florida man packs, some of the money in the bank. He is big chilling in the corner. What the hell? Big chilling in the corner while this string <laughs> of counter after counter just goes on and on. This is some serious parry for parry. Marvel versus Capcom shit. Street Fighter 3 Third Strike only. This is a Daigo Umehara Evo 37. Oh, wait. It's broken up. Wait a minute. We finally Shit's got broken. something up. Punch in the, punch I'd in say the deceased gut. help, but he didn't help yeah. worth a damn. Oh, that wait. Man, deceased didn't do shit. Oh, we got him on the table. It. Dimebag's taking it from him. Dimebag took it from him. With the exploding oh! Blast him. What kind of gay ass tone is that? Get oh that shit out of here. But ladies and gentlemen, with a absolute clean sweep, much like Taz and Screen, your winners of the third match of the yes, first sir. round of the round. Dimebag's moving on. Lil Decease and Dimebag Girl. This means Dimebag's going into round two. We'll see next week Dimebag what happens Carol against uh, yes, Jay and sir. Mayweather versus... Split. The split uh, leg, yes, moonsault, the the Scorp red beard and everything. Oh, Unbelievable. Man. A strong, powerful debut here for Dimebag Doral and his manager, Lil Zan. Two men wearing Dude, jeans. One are cut. Man, look at this man, Doral, bleeding. The Real blood, fighter. The color of the Dimebag Doro wearing the scars of victory across his whole face. But ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to take you back to last week and the previous weeks when this man, Shooter Sago, was not doing too well yes, as a straight shooter. Oh my Brother, god. Actually, what did we just witness? What did we witness? What where, where has Segal been taken? No is he is he in the Hacienda? Is he is he in Mexico? That looked like the Hacienda. That looked like the Hacienda. But who, who took who, him? Who, was, who attacked him? Who was the masked man? Who attacked him? Oh my who god. Who's this masked man that was able to overpower shooter Segal of all people? Oh my god. I am I I am confused. But, but I, I'm having a hard time comprehending this. But ladies and gentlemen, we are now moving on to our next matchup of the evening. Another matchup in the round Russo yes, series. Sir. Making his way to the ring at six feet one inch tall and weighing in at 176.35 pounds. Fighting straight out of Dick's Sporting Goods. <laughs> he is the top dad. He bought his son the new Xbox. Ladies and gentlemen, it is dad season. OG score no matter what happens to Scorp, he's always got the energy coming out here ready for the fight ready to take on any competition that's in store look at him look at this top that's dad energy look at that look at that top dad energy that's because he knows that he has the craziest aarp insurance of all time in case he gets fucked up you know by the way we are sponsored by aarp Yes, sir. AARP for all you old niggas out there so that y'all can stay alive another day. We do not give Taz AARP discounts because, you know, he's Taz. It's Taz, yeah, bro. Yeah. That man stole his name from a Looney Tunes character and he's not even really black. Like, I grew up as a little kid thinking this nigga was a Negro and it turns out that man's not even black. Unbelievable. David and the Latinos can have him. So I think you have your money on Scorp tonight. I have my money on OG Scorp all the way, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, hardcore match. Pray, I would pray that you have your money on OG Scorp as well, Brother X. Oh, I sure do. I sure do. And I think he's got the, like I said, energy in him to put on a crazy hardcore match. And you know what? He doesn't even have to use the weapons. I know he's got the ability to come out here 
and whoops yes, the ass with those strong honest. fists. Oh, wow, shit. And dad fists without weapons. Yes, sir. Them dad fists are serious. He gonna hit him with. He gonna hit him with the ground and pound because he's grounded. <laughs> Here we go. We are uh -oh. underway. Oh, starting shit. off. Goodness, immediate dragon suplex God from Taz. Damn. Not looking too good for OG Scorp. That man got scoliosis. Mm -hmm. Working on the shoulder blade and the neck with the big, big elbows. Picking him Unbelievable. up. Unbelievable. Oh, Kicking a miss from the back. back. Scorp got him up. Oh, suplex. Big Beautiful. belly back suplex. A lot of speed and power to that. Wait a minute. A counter picking him up. Dragon screw leg whip. I think it might have to do with the shoes that Scorp's got big on. The dad hit. shoes always give him the Yeah, uh, he's rocking them new balances. The agility. You know, new balances are worn by dads only. Uh-oh. Bouncing him off the corner into Ooh. a big belly to belly suplex. Really suplex is at the beginning of this match. Not even 30 a seconds in. Jaw breaker. A Ooh. lot of big clothesline. A lot of quick, fast paced technical maneuvering here early on in I'm this already match thinking up. they're this not going to need any weapons. These guys can just use their fists. They might need weapons. They might need. This might just be a 35 minute classic like some Cesaro versus Ooh. Sheamus 7. Big shot, counter kick to the back of the knee. Oh. To take some of the power out of him because it looks like Taz has skipped leg day once. And whoever wins this will move on to the round three, which is a uh, right. the final round. Move on to fight Mario Judens in a it's a 30 minute Iron Man match in a Hell in a Cell. So that's going to be incredible. Whichever man could come out of this Hell in a Cell Iron Man match against Mario Judah, the East Side Champion. Can Mario uh -oh. Judah, the inaugural East Side Champion, retain his title against the tournament winner? And yeah, it's going to be a triple threat too. So it's going to be it's going to be pretty hard for Mario Judah. Yes, sir. You have to you have to think that Mario Judah and all of Sugar Farm Enterprises are watching these matches very closely in the case that they might need to interfere to help the man who says to die very rough. I mean. You're not wrong. I mean, I have I have watched backstage some of the training that you guys have given Mario Judah, and he's out of the bunch of guys you have. He is the one that's lacking in uh, some of the abilities. So you might need to come out yes, there and sir. give him some support. So as he, he is the champion, he did have some luck coming in at the last number there. Uh oh! Absolutely! Oh my God! Right into the Please, fucking well, ladder! Like, on, the Holy shit! The ladder. God damn! That man's hip replacement is Dunzo. Scooping him up. Uh oh. Wait a minute. No oh. counter. Oh, Look dropping him with a reverse DDT. Lo a lot, a lot of Jesus. DDTs tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Scorp got up from that move. My lord. Swooshing right back in. He's uh -oh, ready. Him Wait up. a minute. Scooping him up. Big dead lift suplex. God. Going for it again. No. No. The Northern Lights. Northern Lights. That's Big what beat me. Northern Light. This is what beat oh, me, ladies and gentlemen. I can say that every time. Oh my God. Big ass suplex! Holy look shit! The, look at the technical ability. Where's the referee? Where is the referee? This the man is. Oh my! Ladies and gentlemen, I think the referee might be King Boo from the Super Mario series. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? The referee is Shawn Michaels' former tag team partner, God. Oh! Big gut shot by Taz trying to make a comeback. Trying to keep some of the trying to keep uh -oh. some of the momentum here for screen. Wait a minute, double legs. Oh Set shit! Uh oh, oh. oh. Did you see the way that man just I folded? I think for the Taz one, might be dead. Two. Oh no! I thought out. I thought Taz that man was done. It. Taz is trying to make up for the devastating, humiliating, emasculating loss suffered by his team in the CTE Tag Team yeah. Trauma Tournament. Plus, you beat his ass a couple weeks ago. Yes, sir. His ass got B. Team screen is not doing well. Top rope oh, for no. OG Scorp. Oh, Big my fight. God. Oh, my God. Caught him in midair to a power slam. Is that it, ladies and gentlemen? Oh, just a no, one count. Out. One count. OG Look at Scorp. Dad OG sees Scorp. it. He's off the laxatives. He's off oh. the denture cream. He's, uh -oh. he's poised and ready to go. Wait a minute. <gasps> Looking for the tag. Oh, Looking for the tag. God. God damn. Hit him with the colossus like he's Jinder Mahal. Uh-oh. Setting him up. up, swinging Ooh. neck breaker, taking him down. That man's Over had neck surgery now. before. Going for the cover. One, two, kick out. OG Scorp wow. is old, but he's not washed up. He's not, but Taz is putting in a lot of work on him right now. He yes, knows what Scorp is, is capable of. He really does. Taz is putting in enough work for his entire friggin' stable. This That's... man, Taz, is beyond screen right now. Going for the cover off the neck breaker. 
Oh, we kicked out at the last second. I can't even be. I, I'm trying to understand where the referee is so I can be gassed off of these near falls. <laughs> Someone tell that man to stop being invisible. Oh, snap man into an elbow to the top of the skull. Oh, what's Taz doing? Hopping what's out of Taz the Taz going? What's he getting? Looks table. like Taz. Looks like Taz. He's got a table. He said, I, lo I won the last round with this. I'm going to come in here with this, I guess. I don't know. Yes, Feeling sir. confident. He's Feeling confident, feeling bold, and feeling aggressive. You whipping out the weapons in this hardcore match against OG Scorp, who made a two to one successful comeback in his matchup. Goodness, even with the ropes, he oh. could not defeat the power of Dad Season. Uh oh. All the moms oh. everywhere are looking his goodness. Uh, on his Roddy Strong <laughs> shit, my lord. Racking the arm. Going for the cover, cover off of the lumbar check. Burn. Oh, we pinned him. We got him off the lumbar yes. check. Like Let's go. Cedric Alexander. Let's Ladies fucking go. Here is your winner and making it to the final round of the round. Russo turning. It is OG score. Big yes, ass sir. lumbar check. Flipping that big ugly ass nigga. Look at the power on him. Look at the power on OG score. He is excited. He's ready. He is at. He is ready. Ready to go. He's ready for we'll his find out next week. Single gold. Who will join him in the UK division? This man was the inaugural Fire Pro World Heavyweight Champion, a two-time Fire Pro World Heavyweight Champion. He and sure he is. Many accolades under his belt, but he's trying to add another to his resume yep. as a. Dual East Side Champion, but ladies and gentlemen, we are now moving on to the main event of main the event. Game. It is a school shooter championship, triple threat, shoot elimination style, knockout submission match between dual champion J2 Heel, Sugar Farm Enterprises, Stitches, and Ruby. Hey. Yeah. And making his way to the ring, standing at six feet, two inches tall, weighing in at 231 pounds, fighting out of Miami, Florida, with the brick in your face. He is Los Conquistador del Cocaina, representing Sugar Flurb Enterprises, Stitches. Oh, yes, sir. Stitches coming out here. This is what the Wyatt family should have been, WWE. Listen up. Stitches and all of his posse. Yes, sir. Look at him. He is a dominant, scary-looking individual. Oh, yeah. I don't want to fuck with him. No with a, he got a teddy bear tattoo on one side of his face and an AK-47 on the other. That man is a demon. I would not trust him within, I would not trust him within a 10-foot radius of anyone. He was talking no, about sir. snorting cocaine out of Miley Cyrus's asshole. I don't trust him. <laughs> Can't trust a man like that, but you also can't trust a man like this because he's part of the goddamn Suicide Boys. But let's shout out Ruby the yes, Cherry, sir. ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the ring at five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at two hundred and fifteen pounds, fighting out of what looks to be uh, Toronto, Ontario, Canada. I <laughs> think that's Russ. Must be a French Canadian head ass. He might just be. He might be Ruby de la Cherry instead of Ruby the Cherry. Could Scorp's team pick up two wins tonight, though? I mean, look at this. We've got Scorp's another team. man in here on Scorp's team. Yes, sir. Scorp's, Scorp is very high on the tier list of booking I know. right now. Wild. Talk about yeah, big yeah, booking. Book We've got the man right here. Yes, sir. Speaking of big booking, we have he is the dual school shooter, dual world heavyweight champion and current fire pro tag team champion the man with more booking power than vincent the man with more rigging ability than vincent russo he is j2 heel the man with the most title wins in feta ration history but can he keep his status as j4 belts alive against two devious dominant Diabolical individuals like Ruby the Cherry and Stitches. We'll have to see, man. Look at Stitches right there in the corner. All I see is his big ass head. Stitches is gas, like he is the cocaine Brock Lesnar. We don't see Jim Cornette out here tonight. He looks like he can. Uh... No, Jim Cornette wearing the A. What school do you go to? Championship wrestling 
jacket representing the Federation as one of its uh, top guys. But this is for the A. What school do you go to? Championship Wrestling 2K Division School Shooter Champion chip this is an elimination style shoot fight the only way to win is by knocking niggas out and being the only nigga to not get knocked out we have stitches from sugar flare enterprises ruby de cherry <laughs> from og scorp collective and j2 i gotta, I gotta point something out way. did did ruby the, did ruby the cherry steal my motherfucking undertaker hat because i i swear to god i left that backstage and and i don't know where it is and he now he has my. Have your dead man I am gonna have to was, whoop his ass. I was very confused as to why Ruby De Cherry had a dead man. Listen, I already have my plans for tonight, but I'm gonna have to deal with him later. Just to, just to let you know. Early showboating oh is part of Sugar Flurb Showboating Enterprises. The Ooh, natural selection. Natural selection. By stitches setting up setting up Ruby De Cherry counter. Ooh. Look at Ooh. the world heavyweight champion. He is just. Calm oh and my collected. God! Big book end style Uranagi right Jesus. hand. Uh oh! Just, just J two heel counter big reverse DDT taking him down. Well, Jay was sitting in the corner that whole great. time just chilling. Uh oh! Flippy shit. Standing moon saw big flippy shit. J two flips no fists, ladies and gentlemen. Back suplex no another uh -oh. flip from J two heel. Hurricanrana flip. Of the, top of the face meat in the mouth with the hurricanrana. <laughs> he got meat to show and he showed it to Ruby. <laughs> Oh, Drop what a miss. Couple knees. Sorry, Stitches, big but that was a big botch. Stitches. Oh, shit, right out of the Botching ring. Up a storm. Stitches is definitely off of the Paul Wall Ooh, cocaine. Close line into the corner. Close line in the corner from Ruby to Cherry. J2 Ooh, elbow. Time you time see time that? Outside to recover and recuperate. Meanwhile, these two demonic individuals are just having at it while J2 Heel just simply showboats on the outside. Did you see that elbow by Ruby? I mean, that was like a yes, sir. He Ruby to Cherry Johnson. Oh my god. Yes, sir. Big elbow. Uh oh. He is scooping him up. Oh, we got here. Something. Oh. Goodness, the J2 cutter. That was beautiful, though. Stitches with more trouble. Big right hand. That right hand J2 almost knocked him J2 out. Heel. Knocked him right out of the ring. Reversal by Ruby the Cherry, who I still am having a hard time believing is not Slash from Guns N' Roses. Uh oh. Stitches setting him oh. up. Big gut buster. It was a lot of elevation on that gut buster, ladies and gentlemen. Kicking him down, knocking him down, scooping him up. Oh my God! What just Good. happened there? Good, there's a big collision of bodies. Oh my big, God! Big Holy super shit! J two heel stitches is busted stitches open. Is open. Stitches is busted open. It's not looking good for stitches right now. He's the only man busted oh, open. Oh DDT God though, quick recovered up. He said Stop he loves to bleed. He's he's full of the blood. He Stop likes it. He probably him. drinks his own blood and shit. What a fucking what creep. What is this? What, what kind the of fuck? submission is this? Working the leg. No, breaking it. Ruby to Cherry just showboating in the corner. Oh, he's he picked him up. Taking his time with the Fenty. Top rope. Oh. Big Samoan driver. God, that Samoan taking driver could knock a man out. Champion down. Going for the jumping elbow, and it looks like he might have missed that. Looks like he might have missed that, blow. yeah. Ruby to Cherry inadvertently saving J2 Heel from another natural selection. Ooh. Snap suplex. Knocking right him out of the ring. The prone body of J2 Heel. Knocking him out of the ring. Going for the arm bar. Working him. Big right Ooh. forearm by the world heavyweight champion. A strong showing for the world heavyweight champion who is exuding all of his over exaggerated swagger here in this school shooter triple threat elimination style shoot fight match. Oh my god. Big Stitches back elbow. Insane. Ruby Cherry is recuperating on the outside. Big jawbreaker. Stitch is doing a lot of heavy lifting right now. Big back suplex. Ooh, just got dropped though. Big right hand. Ruby to Cherry just Gassed hauling up. ass. Hauling off on the T and off on the world heavyweight champion. Trying to get himself Ooh. a world heavyweight title shot. Big right hand as Stitches crawls to the corner to recuperate. Arm drag takedown. While he is a dominant, arrogant, unstoppable booking fueled champion j2 heel is Ooh. also a high tier wrestler here in the a will school to go through championship it's going on oh my Federation. god big knee to stitches takes him out as the world nice. champion recuperates on the outside ruby the cherry bounces stitches skull off of the mat over and over and over again stomping on the arm trying to take away some of the power going for a chin lock uh oh j2 heel what's going on back here in the ring 
J2 Heal looks like he's sizing somebody up for something. For real, he's looking at him like he's got some plans. He's got some plans. He's chilling in the corner. Ruby's Wait a minute, got he got up. caught. He got caught showboating by Ruby to Cherry. Wait a minute, oh. off the rope. Snake guys. Oh wait, counter fire is carry takedown. J2 heel with a strong technical showing right here. Oh wait, here. he's got a Oh, this is what knocked out the goal. This is what knocked out the goal. This is what got him. This is what won him the title. This is what won him the title. Oh, he broke out. Ruby is out. Big clothesline taking him out of the ring. Ruby to Cherry and Stitch is one. Oh, he's got him up. Oh, my big gut buster. Look at this. Stitches and Ruby to Cherry are just going They are really showing out. They want to be the shooter champion. They they, what, they know what it takes. What kind of dominant, dominant men are we dealing with? That they are treating the dual champion, a man where a man wearing four oh, belts in the federation, like an afterthought. You're not wrong. Oh shit! What's going on here? Reverse oh. Russian leg sweep. J two heel on the ropes. He's poised and ready. He's poised. Here he goes. Uh oh. He's setting him up. Big Northern Light suplex. Now he's taunting him. More showboating by the dominant. There's dominant been a lot of that in this champion. match. It's been a, it's not a lot of work shown in by Jay. He's kind of sat in the corner. Let these two other men work it out. Exactly. J2 Heel might be able to might be pulling his Apex Legends activities of AFK to W. Oh, he's looking kind of. Oh my God! <laughs> Jesus he's fucking Christ! Outside. Wait, Ruby the Chair is on the top. Uh -oh. oh, what's he what's doing he up playing? there? That thing is a little big. Oh. Top rope, flying elbow, taking down the world heavyweight champion. What is going on? Man, all his cane activities, folks. Look at these two big men. Big swinging neck breaker by Stitches to Ruby. These two are going at it. I'm start. I'm thinking we're going to really be hearing are. a fight forever chant sooner or later. Both of these men are back into uh -oh. the matchup. Belly oh. to belly, suplex by stitches. The world heavyweight oh, champion Jay's back in. his way back into the ring. More showboating. Oh, he no. got caught. He oh, got caught. Oh, my God. Big, big reverse suplex by Jay to heel. Ooh. Stitches with the European uppercut. Yes, sir. He's got him up. Stitches has him set up. What do we have going oh, on here? Oh, Another Samoan driver. Oh, wait, he's wait, out. Wait, wait, he's he knocked him out. He knocked him out. Knocked him out. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Stitches just knocked out the world heavyweight champion. Jay is no longer champion. champion Stitches got it. Holy Jay shit. Three belts. Ladies and gentlemen, J2 Hill oh, just lost God. another title. Both these men are fighting out the him. ring. Wait a minute. Oh, the back breaker. Stitches just dominating Ruby the Cherry. Dominating oh, this matchup. This is wild. What do we have up going on the stairs. Oh, my God. Jay is still down. Jumping, Jay is still the knocked cherry. the fuck out. Jay is still out cold on the outside. Still out cold on the outside. Wait a minute. Oh my lord. By Ruby I'm cherry. shocked. I'm still in dominant. I'm still in disbelief I, here. I am blown oh wait, there's back. Jay. Jay is there's walking Jay out of here. This oh he is upset. Jay is upset. He's pissed. He's pissed. He's pissed. Look at him. Wait, a minute. Wait what? The, oh, my God. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. the sledgehammer. The cerebral assassin. All the cerebral visuals. Bodying oh. the world heavyweight champion. With a I think he has a plan. He, he wants that world title. He, he wants, wants that world title. title. He's showing him right now. Even With the lap. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, just scooping him up. He's oh my God. got meat to show. On the entrance. The last oh my God. ride. Oh. The last ride on the entrance ride. God damn it. Oh, Look my God. This. All the X visuals with an emphatic, emphatic statement. He doesn't need, he doesn't need the Money in the Bank briefcase to take the title from J to heel, ladies and gentlemen. No God way. Damn. I think next we're week we're going to see a world title match. We might have Jay booked in two more matches again next week, just like this week, but oh not as Medea, folks. It's just not looking good. It's not looking good for the world heavyweight champion. It sure His isn't. Dominance. His dominance is slipping ever since the great Muda hit the moonsault. And speaking of the great Muda, OG Scorp, the great Muda's manager, also has Ruby DeCherry in here. Yes, sir. Can we see another title for o the OG Scorp Both? collective? Both these the men have been going off in the entire absolutely match. Absolutely going oh off. This is, a, this is an instant classic. You can hear the crowd going absolutely wild for this. Always back up to the top rope. Top rope again. Oh, oh my god. Top rope again. Oh, oh, my god. And he missed. He missed. He missed the elbow. This is Stitch's chance to capitalize. Oh my god. He's setting him up. Oh my god. He's got him up on the top. He's got him on the top. Go oh, oh my god. He got and the Samoan driver. He got it. He fucking got it. Done. He's done. Ladies oh, and gentlemen, here's your winner, Anthony.
<laughs> hey, what school do you go to? Championship. What a match. A division school shooter. Fucking a. El Coca, El Conquistador, del Coca y Mina. Bitches. Oh my Sugar, god. Slurb, Five star classic. Eating good. The Samoan driver is the most dominant move in the 2K division right now. Goodness, look at this once again. Oh the world Lord. heavyweight champion dropped by the cocaine conquistador. The king of white, ladies and gentlemen. Our new champion. This is insane. Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. He's tell he told him to put it on him, but he wasn't having none Flurb of it. Enterprise is his back, baby. This is insane. Shooter championship. Sugar Flurb Enterprises with two titles in the 2K division. And you have to wonder if the rest of the champions in A with School to Go to Championship Wrestling are now yes, on sir. notice. From Sugar Flurb. Next week. Next week, Lillian, Lillian Garcia, and Lena J. Tukil and Mayweather versus David and Chris Benoit, deceased and Sora Gargano, and more to be announced. And just signed, we got J. Tukil and all the X visuals.